and it's Thursday afternoon. We're having a lot of fun up here. We love to play and we love playing for you. Uh, we're very appreciative to the IDA for the invitation, President Robert Vignet, equipment dude Jason Gert, they've helped us out a lot. Um, we, we would like to say thank you to some people who have really helped us out um, uh, with this concert. It's not just the people up here. Um, if any of these people are here, would you please stand and, and accept some thanks from us? The people who came by and, and helped us rehearse a bit and did some instruction. Uh, Guy, Paul, Dave, Jack, Stan, Ron, David, Lisa, Barry, Leslie, Chris, Grady, Robert, Derek, and, and Steve. You can read the full name of the program if you want to. Maybe any of those folks are here. Please stand up so that we can say thank you to you guys. For, for I know this gets said a lot, but it's, it, it's got to be said every single time. The band boosters and the band parents invest a lot of time, a lot of money, a lot of sweat, a lot of poked holes and fingers, all kinds of things. Uh, if you are a band parent or a band booster executive member, please stand up and let us applaud for you and thank you for all that you do. Every band parent, please stand up. We'd also like to thank the faculty, staff, and administration of Winterset High School. Um, they are very flexible with us. They are very good to us in, in many, many ways. And I think a lot of them are here tonight. So if you are a uh, uh, faculty, staff, administrator, school board member from Winterset, would you please stand up and let us thank you for what you've done. I'm very fortunate to be the current music teacher, band teacher of these students, um, but I'm not the only music teacher in school, and a lot of our music staff uh, have contributed to, to, the, um, to the growth and, and the nurturing of these young people. Our whole music staff is, is here today. Their, their names are in the program, but um, if Megan, Mindy, Jennifer, Sue, and Vicki would stand up and let us thank you for all you've done. High school directors get all these fun things, all the big marching band contests and show choir contests and just all this, all the, the big stuff seems to happen with high school people. And, and it just wouldn't happen without those elementary, middle school and, and junior high directors. And these guys sure wouldn't be where they are today without the person who started them on their instruments, who doesn't teach at Winterset anymore, he teaches at Johnston. But he's here today to say a couple of things. We sure appreciate the groundwork laid by Mr. Josh Morgan. Mr. Morgan. Thank you, Mr. Fire. And uh, wow, you guys sure sure play well. <laughs> you know, back in fifth grade, it just didn't quite sound like this. <laughs> I do have a few remarks directed to the band today. Congratulations. I'm so proud of your accomplishments, and I'm so proud of you. A beginning band teacher rarely gets to see his or her labors go this far. I knew you when you were 10 and 11 year olds who uh, were mismatched. Talking about your clothing choices too. <laughs> Emotional, unruly. But I taught you how to hold those sticks. Taught you where to put your hands on those clarinets. Left hand on top. <laughs> and why you shouldn't be that water key frequently. In my profession, we're kind of like the kindergarten teachers of band. Your music education has been strong and celebrated, but we take note tonight of the other important life lessons that band has taught you. You see, we have watched you grow in character, and we are so impressed by what we see. Through the vehicle of band, you have learned the kind of discipline that will take you through the rest of your life, the kind of discipline that this world so desperately needs from you. You've shown great responsibility and accountability in your successful commitment to this organization. Great leadership as you develop new talent. <clears throat> Great character as you respect the individuals and ideas that have guided you along this path. So, from the days of hot cross buns and go talent roadie, 
spent in a smelly old stinky green building to the prestige and honor bestowed upon you this week as you are showcased before the entire state of Iowa you've come a long way don't ever forget where you've been or more importantly how you got here parents remember this week well it should rank right up there in your list of top 10 accomplishments because it certainly ranks up there in mine. Thank you. <laughs>